What happened? Hmm. Apparently he bought a balloon and he's missing. Fiona! Good morning! Happy Valentine's Day. Today is day 14, last day of vlogging time. And I left it for the last to open my, <clears throat> or start using the bag that came in with the Countdown to Cupid. This is by Blueberry Gaps and i love i love the bag it's quite substantial it looks like a linen on the inside i don't know if you can see and it has drawstrings it's soft but it still have a body to it and i love it i'm gonna use it for socks and i'm gonna place it in my purse because i think it's like purse um worthy <laughs> i'll say that Let's open the last day before I start my day. So the last day is a full skein. <clears throat> it can wrap like this. I'm worried. It doesn't have a name. I guess it's Countdown to Cupid 2033. <gasps> oh, it has a name on the inside. It's, so, it's called B. My Valentine. Oh, look at that. It's so Oh my, she actually surprised me. You know, I thought it was gonna be like, well, you know, I'm gonna have like a very pink. No, it's not, it's perfect. Yes, I love what she did this year. Completely, I love a curveball. Yeah, this is surprising. It's so cute, it's so beautiful. I can use whatever mini I want with this. <gasps> yes, okay. This is gonna be a sock for sure. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much, Amanda. Um, oh my God, yes. I think it was on YouTube. I'm sorry, Carlos. Um, he heats Mimi's um, food here and he doesn't put a lid on. Um, but I follow the instructions of, I think it was on YouTube, or sorry, on Instagram, to place hot water on a cup and then my bread alongside um, to proof. And I will have to say, it's double in size. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in, um, shape it, and then let it rise one more time and then place it on the oven. I think today, I think I have today, uh, time for it today.
guys. It's 9.15. I didn't record much today. I bought for my birthday a Kindle. My son and his girlfriend gifted me a refurbished, cheap, that's what I asked for, Kindle, and I love it. I have read all day and trying at the same time to read and knit. I'm trying to get there. I'm slowly getting there. I made a couple of mistakes. I am reading the court of, uh, what is it? I don't remember. I bought this book um, and I was halfway through and then I lost steam on it to be honest, and I decided to finish it, but I have it here, and I am enjoying it a lot. A Court of Thorns and Roses, I know it's like a tra tra trilogy or something like that, um, but I have spent pretty much all day, um, and I did, you know, did some work on um, packing. I want to apologize. I have, I'm ADHD, so when my environment is not organized, I don't thrive. And I think I have tried to keep my move, like, you know, on the wraps, because we were, you know, trying to make this work. And um, it, did, it didn't work for me here because I was a little scattered and all over the place. Um, so I apologize if you're still here. It's been a joy to open the minis every day. Uh, I love today's yarn. It was kind of like a nice wild card. Um, and I have shared very little knitting, I will have to say. Um, I didn't finish my set that I wanted to do for, you know, not that I needed for today or whatever, but I wanted to have something and um, I'm still waiting for the straps and the fabric that I bought seven days ago. So today they were, they just sent the package today. So it took them seven days to process, which I mean, it's always the same thing with her. This is my second or third time buying from her website and they take forever. So be warned that if you are in kind of like a time crunch, I will think I will definitely finish for the month of February, I hope. Um, because with the move, I don't know how fast I will be able to get it all out of boxes. Um, I didn't work on this shorty sock that I started in January, but I want to finish this one up. And the same for the one that I made um, this, uh, the first couple of days. I have not weaved the toe opening and I have not even started the second one. So I want to, for the rest of the month, finish this. And then also the, the socks that I was knitting in the restaurant that we went for a rest, uh, Mexican restaurant for, you know, for Taco Night. Uh, in Valentine's uh, Day. Uh, I was making that in, I think it's called Salt Water by Summerly, Summerly Knits. Um, this one is a herding cat by Stone Knits. And I have just two more repeats of the cat before I do the decrease of the toes um, and just get and finish the second one. So I hope to finish, I have a lot to finish. So I made like a little card with all the stuff that I want to keep um, accessible for whenever I move, we're gonna move this weekend. So um, besides that, I have work uh, while I knit on this uh, cardigan, the Champagne Cardigan by Petit Knits. And um, it's been a struggle, I will not lie. I, like I said, I have never, uh, been able to knit and read and I have lost a lot of steam. I used to be a very avid reader when I was not a knitter and I think I had let that go because I always make my free time, my knitting time, and I want to combine too because I really, really, really I, I crave that, um, you know, that time to read and I don't know, I used to read every single thing that you can imagine. 
Um, besides that, I wanted to show you guys what I bought for um, today. I went to Target uh, during my walk. I was wearing this um, lipstick. It's, it is um, a dupe for the Violet FR, kind of like silky powdery lip stain it looks like a lip stain but it's a lipstick this is the dupe this is in the color in charge and i love it i wore it all day and now i'm wearing the lip bloom and um it it really stays on and it doesn't feel super dry so it's just kind of like a little you know velvety smooth hue of color it's not glossy it doesn't look like you know like it's um a lacquer or nothing um, and I also bought this one it's called that girl and it's like a very nice um, pinky neutral I will have to say so that's one thing that I wanted to show you guys that I got today and I love because I wore that one this morning I put it on and I was just like whoa you know this is really nice so I went and got tomorrow anyway that's it for me, I'm going to let you guys go and I'll see you guys soon. Uh, thank you for tagging along and um, I see you guys for my favorite recap. And pray for me that I finish something. <laughs> I need to finish this off at least because that's my goal for um, each month to finish a sock. Anyway, I hope you had a great Valentine's Day, um, you know, whatever that is for you. And please know that I'm here for you. I love you all. Thank you for tagging along and spending your precious time with me in my craziness, in my shit show, in my all over the place. I see you guys soon.